Welcome to the tutorial for AWS CloudTrail sources. AWS CloudTrail records API calls made to AWS services such as the AWS Management Console, SDK, and other AWS services providing greater visibility into events in these services that, in turn, allow for security and operations forensics in Sumo Logic through pre-built queries and dashboards in our AWS CloudTrail app. Getting started with AWS CloudTrail takes a few steps, but we will guide you through the process to get you set up. First, make sure that you have logs enabled for your AWS CloudTrail account. AWS has the instructions here. Next, Set up your hosted collector. If you need help setting up a hosted collector, visit our YouTube Micro Lessons playlist to set up a hosted collector. Go to the collections page and choose your hosted collector. Click Add Source. Select AWS CloudTrail Source. This will allow us to pull the logs from your designated S3 bucket. Keep in mind that Sumo Logic will take directly from this S3 bucket. So if you are updating log files in that S3 bucket, we will not pick up the updates. Be sure to name your source something logical and intuitive to you so that you can find it again easily. The description is optional. Next, select your S3 region. Here I am leaving it as others. Enter the name of your S3 bucket where you have stored your AWS CloudTrail logs. Under the path expression, enter the wildcard pattern that matches the S3 objects you would like to collect. You can use one wildcard in the string. Now you need to create a tag for the output of data from this source to tag in the metadata, called a source category. This is the default field for assigning data when you install a Sumo Logic app, our end goal. Specify a logical source category name such as underscore source category equals tutorial slash AWS CloudTrail so that you will be able to find what you need in your searches later. You can specify useful information in the source category such as environment, geographic information, business unit, application name, log type. Here are some examples for AWS CloudTrail logs. Generate the role-based access CloudFormation template for Sumo Logic and download the YAML template. Note that if you download and use the template from the Sumo interface, AWS will not prompt you for parameters like stack name, the S3 bucket name, and the endpoint URL you obtained when creating the source in Sumo Logic. Creating the CloudFormation stack in AWS, Management Console using the template. Copy the role ARN from the Outputs tab and paste it in the role ARN field in Sumo Logic's CloudTrail source. For now, that will be enough. As you get more advanced, you can perform additional pre-processing to refine the data coming in. Click Save to save your source. Check to make sure your source is green on the collections page. This indicates that you're ready to install the app. Before we do that, let's further validate the source by checking the source category in a query window. From the home page, select plus new and select log search. In the query bar, select source category equal and enter your source category name. For me, it will be underscore source category equals tutorial slash AWS CloudTrail. 
you will see log messages returned in AWS CloudTrail format. Thanks for joining.